Hello everyone, this is Atsuki Chef channel, welcome! And if you still didn't subscribe to this channel, please do it now! Amazing recipes, 18 plus humor, guaranteed! You know that I am a big fan of Italian cuisine, so today another famous Italian recipe, chicken alla parmigiana! Watch carefully, do not miss anything! Uh, okay, before I start, let me remind you that all of my videos you can find list of ingredients in the description box okay so don't worry there is all grams kilograms all details okay so let's start our ingredients chicken breast 1 kg and if the pieces is too thick just cut them into a half okay uh, one onion chopped seven cloves of garlic chopped uh, three, four basil leaves, uh, breadcrumbs, plain flour, parmesan cheese, three eggs, spaghetti as a side dish, then I have uh, mozzarella cheese, the real one in the water, like this. Not that rubbish uh, that already shredded in a plastic bag. This is real mozzarella, yeah? So I have four pieces. And then we have Italian chopped tomatoes in juice and then also we have uh, strained tomatoes this is one liter this is half liter and then salt pepper oregano and crushed chili flakes that's it let's move on uh, the first step is very important we need to make marinara sauce and for making marinara sauce you need uh, a pot with a thick bottom so kazan is perfect for that so let's start extra virgin olive oil because it's Italian recipe extra virgin olive oil about three tablespoons yeah uh, okay few minutes later the olive oil is hot and we send in garlic seven seven cloves finely chopped Make sure you will not burn it. This is enough. And I'm sending chopped onion. Uh, reduce heat to medium and simmer it for a while. It's been a five minutes approximately. And at this point we can send tomatoes. And another one, strained tomatoes, half liter, also all in. So the cooking time of marinara, it's approximately 35 to 45 minutes. So let's wait. And at the very end, I'm gonna add salt, pepper, little bit of oregano and fresh basil, finely chopped. See you later. And please don't forget to stir it time by time, okay? By the way, belated Merry Christmas everyone. I forgot. Merry Christmas. So it's about 30 minutes cooking. At this point, we're gonna add salt, pepper, oregano, and basil. About full teaspoon of salt. We're gonna check it later on. Black pepper. Oregano, chili flakes, just a little bit, finely chopped basil, stir it up, at this point uh, reduce heat to minimum and let's give another 5-10 minutes and we'll try the taste later on. Okay, time's up. It's been cooking for 35 minutes and let's try the taste. Let's try the taste. Mm -hmm. So nice. You just can take spoon and eat it. That's it. The only thing I, I feel we can add just a pinch of salt. Just a little bit, little bit of salt. Okay, our marinara sauce is ready. By the way, uh, marinara, it means seamen's. 
Uh, this sauce was invented in Naples, uh, and the first tomatoes were brought by by sea. Uh, it was exactly in Naples, so uh, this marinara sauce is it comes from Naples. Okay, our sauce is ready. We switch off the fire and put it on a side. That's it. And the next step is chicken, and what we're gonna do now is. It's just the, the same way like we're doing a chicken schnitzel, same process. Put some film and we need to beat it up. That's it. And this is the chicken what we need, okay? So see you later once I finish all. Uh, okay, chicken is ready. You can see it's absolutely flat, like my carrier, and I already put salt and pepper, all right, both sides. Okay, right now we have three stages, the same way we're making the, what it's called, uh, sh chicken schnitzel. So, flour, three eggs, and breadcrumbs. There's nothing to do with flour, the three, three eggs we need to beat up right now. I'm gonna focus on the breadcrumbs because it's not just breadcrumbs. Apart from that, we're gonna put some salt in it. I'm gonna put some salt. We're gonna put some pepper, black pepper. And we need to put some oregano. So that's it. Okay, and right now there are three steps to process our chicken. First step is flour. So chicken goes into the flour, like this, and then it goes into an egg. It goes into the egg. And the last step is a uh, breadcrumbs. Okay, let me show you closely. This is the last step. And our breadcrumbs has a garlic and black pepper and oregano. It's already full of aroma. So this is the way how we process chicken. Okay, once I finish all, I'll show you the result. Uh, guys, remember in my previous video I told you I'm gonna buy the new pen. So here it is. Please welcome my new gadget. And we're gonna test it today. And also, Merry Christmas! And please remember, we just need to golden brown the chicken. We, it doesn't have to be cooked, okay? Okay, this is good enough. And straight away the the rest. So once I finish all, I'll show you the result. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. So we're taking container for baking start putting the marinara sauce on the bottom and try to spread it okay we spread the sauce marinara and on the top of it we place the chicken okay here okay Right now, we're gonna place the remaining of our sauce on the top of our chicken and try to spread it. Uh, check this out. I slice all pieces of mozzarella. One, two, 
Okay, uh, please have a look. Uh, we placed all the mozzarella cheese on the top of chicken and marinara. And right now we're gonna place some parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese on the top. Okay, uh, spaghetti is done. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Okay, this is ready. Please have a look. Chicken alla parmigiana. Okay, guys, shall we try? Camera woman on duty, so I'm making video myself alone. Anyway, let's try. Mm. So nice. Definitely, you need to try this recipe. And I believe I deserve like from you, comments. Don't forget to smack the like button. Thank you, thank you for watching, see you again guys.